Hey guys, got something new here for you. I'm going to be weaving in some of these self-storage stories throughout the episodes for the self-storage show. They're fun, okay? <laughs> I, I started this a couple weeks ago and been gathering some of the stories and man, they're, they're, they're crazy. Uh, again, those of us in the self-storage industry, we all got stories. I got them, you got them. It's just, it comes with the territory. And I want to hear them, and so do the listeners of the Self Storage Show. Come on, it's kind of fun. So go to selfstoragestories.com. Just, hey, just go on your phone, click a button, just record it, and that's it. Okay? It's very easy, totally anonymous. You know, don't have to tell us <laughs> uh, who you are or where you're at. Just just give us a story, cool? You know, just any kind of a crazy or, or a great story or whatever. You know, good, bad, the ugly. Just want to hear some stories, sort of, sort of the listeners of the Self Storage Show. So again, go to selfstoragestories.com and contribute. Thanks a lot, and I look forward to hearing your story. See ya. I was working for a storage company. I was in with my first six months of being there. We were hosting an auction. It was live on site at that point, and... There was one unit there that was like a 10 by 10, and all it had in it was an old beat up dresser in a black garbage bag, and we could not get anybody to bid on it. And so finally, we convinced a guy to please just pay us $5 for it and throw the stuff away for us so that we didn't have to deal with it. He paid us $5, he went back out to the unit, uh, we were making jokes with him, like, ha ha, have fun cleaning that out. And about five or ten minutes later, he comes back up to the front office and slams a metal box down on our desk. And he said, ladies, would you like to help me count this? And inside of the box was like $2,500 in cash that was hiding inside of the dresser drawer. So you just never know what you're gonna get when you purchase an auction.